Hi, and welcome to Cool Gadgets and Stuff. Building a new home comes with a lot of decision making and choosing the right construction system is one of the more important ones. Building technologies continuously improve. And in this video, we're gonna explore some interesting building systems that you might not be familiar with, but are worth checking out. This is our sixth video on building systems, so be sure to check out our home building playlist as well. Lincoln Block is a structural wood block building system that offers a fast, strong, and affordable alternative to traditional wood framing techniques. It is also greener since the wood used comes from surplus economy grade lumber, upcycled from lumber mills, which is not suited for dimensional framing and would typically be used for pallets or wood chips. A special assembly jig puts it all together, along with high strength adhesive and steel nails to create blocks two to 10 feet in length. The backbone of the system are spline pieces interconnecting each block. The structural polyurethane insulative spray foam occupies the hollow wall and every course of block is glued forming a thermal break between the interior and exterior of the structure. Additional spline pieces interconnect each course of block and transmit point loads around doors and windows. Tie downs, anchors for structural supports, conduits, and boxes are all hidden in the wall. Each course of Lincoln block is finished as you stack it, providing all-in-one siding, framing, and drywall replacement in the form of a single block product, thus reducing labor hours and cost of additional materials. By simplifying the entire envelope of a house down to block patterns that always fit together, the company has redefined the fundamental design of a house. The company wants to offer affordable and easy-to-use housing solutions that provide high quality long-lasting, and sustainable homes. Earthbag construction describes a building method where the main building components are sandbags, stuffed with soil and stacked on top of each other, along with strands of barbed wire, placed in between each layer to lock the bags in place, similar to mortar. The bags used can be made of natural materials like hemp or burlap, or more durable synthetic materials like polypropylene, which is rot-resistant. The bags are filled with 70% sand and 30% clay, and sometimes cement aggregate as well, and are laid in courses to build the walls. Walls can take straight forms and topped with conventional roofs, or they can be rounded and even dome-shaped. Vertical rebars and bond beams can also be integrated. The soil can be dug from the foundation trench, lowering the embodied energy commonly associated with the manufacturing and transportation of building materials. The classical foundation used in earth bag construction is a rubble trench foundation. Here the building uses its own weight to anchor itself to the foundation, with no beams, bolts, or rebars, enabling it to move independently, minimizing the shock transfer to the walls in case of an earthquake. Earth bag walls have great thermal mass properties, or the ability to store heat, providing inertia against temperature fluctuations but are poor at insulation and less filled with lighter materials, such as crushed volcanic stone, perlite, or rice holes, or if a secondary insulating layer is added on the outside of the shell. For permanent housing, the earth bag walls should be covered with some kind of plaster for protection. Earth bag buildings are notable for their low cost in materials, low skill in building experience, and being eco-friendly, sustainable, and healthy to live in. Construction 3D printing is a method for manufacturing elements or entire buildings by means of depositing a material like concrete layer by layer via an extrusion machine that can move autonomously according to the preset layout. This method has the potential to revolutionize the construction industry. Construction 3D printers can produce concrete structures quickly and cost effectively with a significant degree of design flexibility. It makes no difference to the printer whether the walls are straight or curved. This technology is yet to take off as a widespread building technique, but projects are starting to pop up all over the world. In this segment, we're going to take a look at two companies at the forefront and cover some of their notable projects. Danish company Kobod has created BOD2, a modular 3D printer that can print multi-story buildings. This robotic construction printer has a modular truss structure 
that can be scaled to suit projects of varying sizes. In collaboration with Perry Construction Company, the BOD2 printer has been used in two residential projects in Germany. First in a single-family two-story building, which was the first 3D printed building in Germany with building accreditation, paving the way for larger and more complex projects, like the latest Perry Team project of printing the largest 3D printed multifamily house in Europe with 380 square meters of living space, divided into five apartments across three levels. During the printing process, the printer takes into account the pipes and connections for water, electricity, and more that are to be laid out at a later time. This means that manual work, such as the installation of pipes and connections, can be easily integrated into the printing process. Another company, Icon, a Texas startup, wants to deliver affordable and dignified housing to people around the world. Using their construction printer, the Vulcan 2, they plan to produce resilient, single-story buildings fast and affordably. To achieve this, they've partnered with multiple nonprofits and are working on projects from Latin America to their hometown of Austin, Texas, where in partnership with Mobile Loaves and Fishes, a nonprofit serving homeless, the printer is used to construct homes for formerly homeless residents at Community First Village, where just recently they had their first resident move into a 3D printed home. The 400 square foot 3D printed home features one bedroom, one bathroom, a full kitchen, a living room, and a large porch with a sweeping sunset view. Currently, this is one of seven 3D printed homes by Icon in phase two of the planned community, aiming to provide affordable, permanent housing and a supportive community for men and women coming out of chronic homelessness. Fastwall by Shelterworks out of Oregon is an ICF-like mineralized woodblock building system made of recycled wood fiber mixed with a small amount of Portland cement. The wood chips are mineralized in a special process that removes sugars from the wood, making the wood chips inert and not susceptible to rot or insects. Combined with the high pH environment of the blocks resulting from the cement content, the wall system also helps to inhibit mold growth. The cement wood vapor blocks are vapor permeable and regulate the humidity or moisture content of a room, creating a healthy indoor environment. Blocks are simply stacked on top of one another without mortar. The interlocking tongue and groove design keeps the wall forms in place. Rebar is set both horizontally and vertically within the stacked forms, Prior to filling the cores with concrete, this creates a post and beam grid effect, which makes the walls exceptionally strong and can withstand anything from hurricanes to earthquakes. Integrated 3-inch rock wool insulation on the outside of the concrete cores insulates the thermal mass into the interior of the building, enabling the transfer of heat between the concrete mass and the interior space, which enhances the insulating value and significantly reduces the energy needed to heat and cool buildings. Electrical wiring can be cut into the walls, or plumbing and electrical can be installed prior to pouring concrete. A vapor permeable finish is recommended for the interior and exterior of a fast wall structure. Fast wall formed concrete structures may be utilized for one to three story buildings in the residential and commercial sectors. It is ideal for building highly energy efficient durable, and sustainable homes in commercial buildings. Silka is the latest brand in the Zella Group product line. The company best known for its Hong Aircrete blocks, which we covered in a previous video on building systems. Silka calcium silicate blocks, first introduced in Europe in 1995, have a high density of material resulting in some unique properties such as very high acoustic insulation, high compressive strength, and high thermal mass. Silka blocks can offer as much as 58 decibels of sound protection, depending on the thickness of the blocks, which is especially suitable for insulation in buildings where good sound protection is very important, such as hospitals, kindergartens, walls between housing units, and more. Itong and Silka are made from the same raw materials, but in a different ratio so the final products differ considerably from each other in density, weight, thermal and sound insulation, and more. The two systems are compatible with each other, so they can be used together to build an optimal facility. Silka comes in two versions, 
a fast track system suitable for medium to large scale developments, and a small block system that can be deployed in smaller to medium sized projects, where it is not possible to work with large formats. Due to the high compressive strength of silicate blocks, even relatively thin walls can withstand heavy loads, therefore saving on material and net surface of the building. The material is also highly resistant to fire. A significant amount of alkaline lime in the composition of the product is a natural protection against fungi and mold. Silica building blocks, because of their non-combustible, sound insulating, load bearing, and thermal properties, are a great solution for projects of all sizes, offering an optimal solution to ensure the stability and longevity of buildings. Thanks for watching. More building related videos are coming soon. Until next time.